Good morning you guys, this is Strawberry Singh and today is Swag Bag Day. Today I'll be opening up Swag Bag September 2016. If you're not familiar with Swag Bag, please click the link in the description of my video. It's for my blog post, it'll give you details. It's basically a subscription box, a monthly subscription box for male avatars in Second Life. Um, if you had signed up for September, the theme for September was adventure it's well it is adventure and um if you had signed up using their kiosk then you should have gotten the swag bag sent to you as soon as you logged in today and it's, you'll find that in your objects folder i've already actually resed it and uh saved the boxes but i just want to show you what the swag bag looks like real quick so this is the front and then you click on it and there are always 15 designers participating in swag bag each month. Um, so I'm just going to name you the designers real quick. David Heather, Ellen B, Backbone, oops, my camera is going over there. Uh, Lettuce Tattoo, Clav, Draught, which has replaced... Um, to drop oh yeah drop replace mad design this month uh come soon poses sio sis modulus i believe this one is uh can't read it minimal this one is ethem nomad G uh, and gabriel and zoom is a new one this month which is uh, a last minute replacement for unorthodox so unorthodox and mad design are not in it this month zoom is the last minute replacement because of that uh zoom item is not in the box today it will be sent uh sent uh through the swag bag tomorrow okay so just keep an eye out for that once you're or i think you have to go to the swag bag headquarters to get a um redelivery and then you i'm not sure actually I'll, I'll link to the swag bag website to figure out how how to get the zoom item anyway so this was all that you click on each box to unpack it or um, you can unbox all of them and then you get all of them coming one by one I've already unboxed uh, all of that so I'm gonna just put that away and I have a folder ready to go to save time okay and hopefully it won't be as long as last time try and go a little bit faster okay this first one we're gonna open is I guess this one is uh, Gabriel but let's see looks like Gabriel yeah it's Gabriel okay Oh, it looks like it's a jacket and scarf. Oh, actually, I didn't actually tell you guys what I'm wearing today. I don't really change my male avatar that that often. I actually wore a lot of the last month swag bag um, items in the, in the past month whenever I logged them in. Um, if you want any of the items that I'm wearing right now, if you look in the blog post, I'll have a link to all of them. But quickly, I'm wearing slink jeans. I'm wearing cold ash jacket. Uh, this is a catwa head, and this is modulus hair from the last swag bag, okay? Alright, so let's try on the Gabriel stuff. It looks like we have pants, and he has that in slink and TMP. And the jacket he has in slink and standard and TMP, and the scarf he has in slink, standard, and TMP. And that's the texture change head. Oh, and he also has the pants in standard. That's great. So I am going to remove my jacket and I have to fix my alphas, but let's see. I'm wearing the slink mesh body. So I'm just gonna put on the slink version and I have to fix my alphas. There you go. Oh, this is nice. It's got that khaki color to go with the adventure theme, nice. Okay, so the scarf, let's put the scarf on, wow, 
Hmm, the scarf is clashing a little bit. I wonder if we can move this around. Is it rigged? It's rigged. Okay. And it's a little bit like uh, clashing and they're both the slink size. So I don't know if I can wear them together. But it's a nice scarf. Hopefully it will fit with some other kind of jacket. All right. Pants. Putting the pants on first so I don't get all naked in front of you guys. Oh, the pants come with boots. Nice. Okay, so I'm going to remove my jeans. Slink. These are the jeans. Nice. I like this. So I'll have to remove my sh my feet. Let me see. My slink feet. There we go. Perfect. This is cute. I like that. I really like the pants and the boot combination a lot. I wish we could have worn them separately because it's all in one piece. Like if he had the boots separate from the the pants, that would have been that would have been good. But I guess that's cool. That works. So the only the only issue that I see here is this little clash, and since it's rigged, I can't move the scarf. So, but what we can do is play with the texture HUD. Okay. Oh, okay. So we have the texture HUD is just for the scarves. And uh, can play with the colors a little bit. It's nice. Um, I like it. I like. I really like the pants and the boots combination a lot. I really like that. That is very. Uh, those boots are awesome. I really do wish they were kind of. They were kind of separate, so you can wear them with other things, but looks good. Okay, so that is Gabriel. Alright, next one we have Nomad. Try and go fast. Looks like it's a- oh! Cable car. It's fine by the two incidents. A place in the Soviet Union Russia. Okay, so it's an inspired Peace. I'm gonna read that later. Okay. So I guess I res it. Whoa. Nicely done. I wonder if there's like poses and stuff in it. Can you sit on it? Oh, the door's open. Okay, there's no like poses in it, but it's. Beautiful. Look at the texture on this. Very nice. I like it. Okay, so I'm gonna move it back there. Um, oh yeah, the ally. Last time I totally forgot to give the land impact on all of them. This one has an ally of 23, okay? If you're gonna display it on your sims. Okay, let me just stand back on my post stand. What's next? Did I just lose Manberry? I don't know where he went. Okay, there he is. <laughs> I saw playing things on me. Okay, so I'm gonna do Ethum is next. This looks like a shirt. Let me zoom into myself. Okay, so they have Signature Slink Standard and TMP, and there's also a color HUD. So we're gonna put on the Slink since I'm wearing Slink, and remove this jacket. Avatar complexity. I gotta do a. Okay, so we need to fix this. Trying to get my torso all properly alphaed out for you guys. There we go. See how the back looks. I gotta fix my arms a little bit. There we go. This is nice. I like this shirt a lot. So this is Ethan. Okay, so the HUD. Let's check out the HUD. 
Oh, it's a big hut. Okay, let's move it over here. Okay. Wow, that's a lot of colors. And then you can even change the buttons. Nice. I like it. Let's try a few of these colors. I love this green. Nice. Okay. This is a great shirt. I really like that a lot. Okay, so the next thing that we're gonna open up. I'm just gonna detach this. Okay, next one we have is David Heather. Looks like it's a bag. Okay. Coughing there a little bit. So we got a bag and then we got a HUD. Oh, this is nice. It's interesting. It's an adventurer's bag. Pretty cool. It's got a little rope and hook there too. Okay, so let's check out the HUD. I like the... Okay, so you can... Uh, the texturing is very nice. Um, comes in four colors. Really nicely done. I like the hold too. The hold that it comes with. Oh, I like the moss green. Very nice. This is really cool. Good job. Okay. Um, what's next? LNB. No, LNB had my favorite item last month. It was that jacket. I forgot the name of the jacket. So let's check this month's out. Oh, this looks cool. Looks like pants or something. Okay, so let's see. Uh, yeah, they're leather pants. Nice. So we have, um, this is the HUD for the pants. We have for the aesthetic body, for classic avatar, so that's standard sizing. And this is for slink. So I'm going to put on the slink ones. I'm going to have to detach some of this stuff so we can see properly. And there goes my, fix my pose. Let me remove the other pans. I think there were... Gabriel, there we go. Oh no, I have to put my feet back on. Oh, wow, these are really nice. Okay, so... Um, let me just quickly put my feet back on. And I'm gonna take this shirt off too so we can see the stuff properly. There we go. Perfect. This is really, really nice. Look at these pants. Gorgeous. I like the little pouches on the side. This is, what is this? Explosive. Whoa. Nice. Okay, let me fix the health on here. There we go. Okay, so let me see, was there a HUD? Mm, LNB. Wear the HUD tactical other pants. There we go. Okay, let's see. Okay, well. Um, mm, what is this? Okay, so this is the colors of the okay that I like the green a lot this, this one is nice too and then there's black as well I think I really like the green 
And then this is... Let's see. Okay, these are brighter colors. Okay, that's cool. So you can go with pink. I'm gonna go back to the green because that one I really liked. And anything else? Okay, so I can change. Wow, a lot of options here. You can turn off the the explosives. Uh, turn them back on. You can change the, their colors. You can change the colors of the belt. Okay. A lot of options. Very detailed. I like it a lot. Nice pair of pants. Perfect fit for the sl slink body. Okay. So now, what's next? I'm trying to move faster, you guys. Um, backbone. Okay, backbone is a bookcase, looks like. So let's put it on this side of me. We res it here. Hopefully it's not too big. Okay. Let's sit backwards. Oh, whoa! It's like a mummy book bookcase. Very nice. Goes well with the theme. This would look awesome. In, a, in like a perfectly themed uh, bedroom or somewhere. Really nice. Nicely done. I like the way it opens too. Oh, that is cool. Okay, so that was backbone. Then we're gonna do modulus. Wow, I'm really coughing today. I hope I'm not getting sick. Did I lose a modulus? I don't know if I. Uh... Okay, there it is. So it looks like you get a free hair base fat pack and oh these cuts ooh these look bloody okay so I hope they have a catwa plier I'm wearing a catwa head let's see we got oops so we have um, this is the hair base okay it's an omega plier Cheek cut, cheek scratches. Okay, so they only have Omega applier, which is fine. Bleed. Okay, so each cut is different. This is pretty cool. So you can like, oh, and then they have TMP appliers as well. So you can have like whatever scratches you want. Okay, so I'm gonna put on my Catwire Omega Relay HUD. If I can just find that. There it is. Okay, so. Let's see. If I do the cheek cut, I don't want, uh, I probably want it on like blush. So, this is the uh, Omega Plier HUD for the cheek cut. So, I'm gonna. Hmm. I guess I'll do default zone. I don't know. How this works exactly. I'm not that familiar with Omega. Did I do it right? Okay. I'm probably not gonna do- ooh, it looks pretty bloody. I'm thinking I have to turn on in the Catwa HUD because that looks black. So Because I have it set to black in the Catwa HUD. Let me quickly- I'm wearing the Justin head. Hmm. The main HUD. Okay, in the Kawa HUD, I have, I think, um, let's see. Let me move this a little bit. So if I'm doing the, uh, I don't know, is it this one? I think I have to turn it white. Guess not. Is it this one? Nope. Hmm. Blush. There we go. I have to turn that white. Okay, so now it looks like blood. Alright, very cool. So, 
I'm going to try just like one or two of the others because um, this might take a while. Let's do, a, I'm not, ooh, I don't like nose blades. Let's try mangled cheek. That kind of looks freaky. Um, I'm going to do the default zone. Is it going to replace the other one? Yeah, okay. See, it's going to replace the other one. I have to figure out how to apply it. Oh, that looks gross. But this is pretty cool. This is really nicely done. Okay, I have to figure out which layers to apply it. Uh, Omega is a little bit confusing in that way. I guess if I press con HUD control and then I choose like... Um, if I press head HUD control and I choose like I want this one on the eyelids and this one on the brows, etc. Et they won't overlap each other. So, gotta figure that out. I don't really want to get into all of that right now because kind of in a rush but I will check out oh I should have kept the uh, I want to check out the um, the relay hut I want to check out the hair base as well I'll show you guys that it's like a part of this okay so do I just attach this oh I have to unpack the hair base okay That messed up my... Okay. <clears throat> there we go. So let's see with the hair base. They have Omega and TMP. And uh, Omega and TMP. Yeah, okay. So I'm going to go with brown. Do they have brown? Yeah, here we go. So I'm going to go... Hmm... Over here, so it gives you options of four browns. I think I, I I wear brown four. So I'm gonna go with default zone. See if that worked. Yeah, that worked. Cool. So this is the hair base that comes with it. Nice. Looks pretty good. Okay, so those are the two things that come with in the modulus pack. Okay. I'm going slow guys sorry let's do this okay we've done modulus um sis now sys i don't know do you pronounce it sys or sis sys wasn't i didn't get it in the video last um month because there was a scripting issue so they had released it a few days after uh, and it was like a shirt of some sort. It was it was pretty nice. Okay, so they have fitted mesh signet for the signature body for slink and for TMP. Uh, they have shorts and a t-shirt. Nice. So I'm gonna put on the slink, and then I'll uh, oh those are the shorts. Okay, and then I'm gonna put on the shirt, and we will remove the L and B pants. Oh, that's it's like denim shorts. Let's get up, get my legs back. Okay. Hmm. It's not bad. I don't know. I don't know about the back, but yeah, it's cute. I don't know if I'd really wear this. Not really my style, but it's a, it's a cute little outfit. I think it's good for the adventurer theme for sure. That's for sure. Okay, next one we have is, this is a note from Mad P about Zoom. Uh, so basically they're saying mm, they were replaced at the last minute, uh, unorthodox with Zoom. So Zoom will send their item tomorrow and you will get a new swag bag crate. Your crate will deliver this uh, this uh, his item on demand when it becomes available. Okay, so it, it sounds like according to this message that it will automatically be delivered to us so uh, I'm going to just delete that okay so the next one we have <coughs> is minimal I'm gonna open that up quickly minimal makes accessories I believe yes we have glasses and we have a necklace I love glasses. I want all the glasses. Okay. Alright, so I'm gonna move this shirt so you guys can see the necklace properly. 
Let me just, oh good, it's not rigged. Let's get this on me properly. Perfect. Mm, could be my pose is doing this. There we go. Not bad. Let's zoom in on this necklace. What is that? Oh, it's an airplane and a passport. That's really cute. It's perfect for the theme. I like it. It's cute. Okay, and this... These are the shades. So, oh my god, the mummy behind me just totally freaked me out. <laughs> I was like, who's that standing there? Okay, um, let me see. Does this... Can, can I make this a little bit bigger? Oh, perfect. I need to make it fit my... Big head. Okay, here we go. Perfect. Kind of. I'm going to move it back a little bit. And maybe a little bit down. I think that's good. How are the ears looking? Not bad. I think I could probably uh, make it a, a little bit bigger, but I'll leave it for now. I like it. I like these shades. Is there like a... Okay, they only come in one color and stuff. That's cool though. Very nice. He looks kind of hot. Okay, so we got minimal. What's next? Okay, minimal. Sayo. It's a tree dome. Oh, nice. Getting a lot of uh, home decor type stuff. Nice. Look at that. I like the, the fact that um, swag bag has themes because then you kind of get like uh, the same feel for all the items, you know? It's, it's pretty cool. I guess I'm just going to res it here. Oh, it's like a hanging bed. So cute. So you can like hang this from a tree outside. Uh, this is the front. So it's probably got some poses in there. Let's check it out. Cool. Okay. So let's see. They have. Can you guys see this? Okay. They have for singles, couples, and they have adult poses. Nice. So I'm going to try some of the single cup poses. This is Basque, Lazy, Bored, Goddess. <laughs> sure, I can be a goddess. Edge. So this kind of look like unisex poses a little bit. Leg up. Lean, relaxed. Yeah, so I like this leg up one a lot. It's cool, and I can adjust it. I can press the adjust button to move it around. But yeah, I like it. It's nice. Okay, so that was Sayo. Or Sayo, I hope I'm saying it right. You guys have to correct me if I pronounce stuff right. Just leave it in the comments. Like, no, you said it wrong. Okay, so draught is hair. So I'm going to put myself back on this. Okay, and let's open up draught. Okay, draught twig hair. Mm hmm. Actually, the cut looks kind of cool there. Might wear it for a while. All right, so I, you can. That's the okay. So it also comes with a hair base. Um, how does the hair base work? Is it like? Oh, okay. I think it is a um, mesh hair base. Yeah, it is. Okay, so how do I get rid of my other hair base? Let me see if I can do that. Mm. Clear my hair base layer? Nope. Where's the hair base here? It's in my hand. Oh my god. Okay. <laughs> so I'm going to open up the hair base, see if it's only tattoo layers or if there's any appliers for mesh heads. If there's only appliers for mesh heads, I can't wear the hair base. Let's see. Yeah, they only have appliers. I hope it does the hair doesn't require wearing a hair base, but let's see. Yeah, I think you kinda need a hair base for this hair. 
But look at the hair. It's cool. It's got these little twigs in them. I like it. Um, so these these are the HUDs. I like this hair color though, so I'll leave that. Uh, they have different colors and draught hair base black. Okay, there we go. Hair base applier. Sweet. So I'm going to put on my Catla Omega Relay HUD again. Where's my Relay HUD? Come on. So I'm going to click this to apply the hair base. There we go. And it's a little blurry. Nice. That's pretty cool. I like that hair base. Uh, front, front is a little bit on the blurry side, but not bad. Pretty cool. So this is draught. Okay. I like that hair. Okay. So we got Draught in here, and Draught was a replacement for Mad Design from last month. Uh, I did. Did I open up the style? Yeah, I did. So next one we have is Clav. We're almost there, you guys. I hope I didn't lose you. Okay. So these are goggles. I have to take off my shades? No, I don't wanna. Okay. <clears throat> so, tilted left. What does that mean? Okay, cool. So, different ways of wearing them. Can we just wear them on our eyes? Yeah, you can. Pretty cool. And they fit? Wow, it's like almost a perfect fit. Let me see if I can. Uh, Make it bigger. Hmm. Can't stretch it. Oh, but I can stretch it that way. Okay, so we want to do an X stretch, I think. Yeah. Perfect. Look at that. Awesome. Loving it. These are really cool. Wow, look at the texturing on that. That is beautiful. Okay. So, very adventurer. Um, so, last thing we have. No, there's two more things. Yeah, I did that one. That's the CS. What's CS? Oh, that must be the come soon poses. Okay. Now, they always have very big items. Let me see if they have the same. I might have to delete some of the stuff behind me. Come soon poses. Adventure. Well, maybe not. Let's see. Let's move this over here. Okay, so adventure one. Okay, I have to open these boxes. So this one is adventure one. Oh, okay. So this has got like cars and stuff. I wonder if the background is uh, part of it too. I might have to um, find a bigger place to res this. Yeah, it looks like the background might be a part of it, but let's check it out. I'm going to try and see what happens. I really like all the detail that they put into it. That's pretty cool. Whoa, this is huge. My, my goodness. Okay, one thing I forgot to tell you guys. I don't know, remember if I did. This was 23 LI. The bookcase was 13 and the tree dome was 11, okay? And this one is, wow, this one is 140 land impact. That's a lot, but I guess when you're like just resing it, proposing, that's cool. So I'm just gonna move it here okay so do I just sit oh my god that is so cool I love this oh my god the look at the little tree man back here this scene is awesome this is very very cool 
So that's the other, if you have another person to pose with you, that's pretty cool. And you can, oh, okay, they have handguns. And I don't know what this is. Okay, those are the poses. There's a telescope. Cool. So you can do telescope or uh, handgun. Okay, so this is like parchment paper. It's like a map. So the handgun really doesn't belong in there now, does it? So I'm just going to remove that. This is pretty cool. I like this. Very detailed. Okay, so let's get rid of all of that. And I'm gonna... I don't know if the other scene is the same, so we'll see if I res it. Full scene. Okay, is it similar? No, oh, it's a little bit different. It has a different car. Um, what do we do? Oh, this is really cute. Oh my goodness. Look at the detail. I really like, I really like the way they did this. Okay, so, and then you, okay, so they have a telescope here. Nice. Really, I, this, I really like this pose. And I love the little tree man in the back. But nicely done. So this LI is 180 as well. Okay. That was pretty cool. Okay. So now... I'm gonna go back on my post stand, which I've lost. Okay, and I think I'm on the last box now, which is lettuce tattoo. Okay, so lettuce tattoo, uh, they have um, a pliers. Well, first they have tattoo in in the uh, tattoo layers, and then they have appliers for the signature body, the atom body, Beleza, so that's for the females, Matreya, so that's for the females, and Omega, a slink, and the TMP. So I'm going to put on the slink. The slink would also work for the female slink as well. And the HUD looks like this. So let's try the 50% shade. Not working. Oh, I might have to turn on the tattoo layer. Um, yeah, there we go. Okay. Nice. So this is the lettuce tattoo that comes in the swag bag this month. So this is pretty cool. Look at all the items. Um, I, I like the fact that we got a lot of home decor stuff and uh, these poses and this whole scene is just phenomenal. I mean, come soon poses. I was really impressed with them last month as well. And this month they did not let, let us down. Uh, there were a lot of uh, the clothing was nice. I really like the LNB pants. Uh, the David Heather bag was really awesome. Um, uh, what else? The hair was, I like this little twig hair. I, I'm not sure about the hair base. I might try a different hair base, but the, the hair is, is, is nice. Uh, so all in all, I think it was definitely worth it. It's, it was 1500 linens, of course, for, uh, September. It is every month. Now, if you still want this, I think tomorrow they'll have it up for sale at the swag bag headquarters for double the price for 3000. And then you can also sign up for October. Uh, it's always fun to open up the box and surprise yourself and see what you're getting. Uh, so if you want any more information about the Swag Bag headquarters and the Swag Bag uh, website and stuff, I'm going to link to all of that in my blog post. And again, uh, you'll find my blog post in the description of the video. Um, I hope you liked the items in the box this month. I, I kind of did. I, I did a lot. I'm, I think with this scene, I'm going to take try taking a picture. Uh, I think it's going to look pretty cool. But um, uh, uh, don't forget to subscribe and leave any comments for me to answer if you have any questions. And I'll see you guys next month. Uh, there's more subscription boxes coming out soon for men, I believe. So keep an eye out for that. I'll talk about it in my blog post. And, um, and Luxbox is going to be out soon too. So I'll talk to you guys later. Okay, bye.